In Fallout 2, there are plenty of places to explore and plunder, but the Chosen One still has a lot to look out for. Whether it's the people of the post-war wasteland, the various genetically twisted creatures, or just a puddle of goo, one should be careful where they trek when out in the wastes. In some areas, like the toxic caves, we can see presumably radioactive waste covering the site. Sometimes we have to walk through it to get to where we are going. Rubber boots can offer a bit of protection from this goo, still, eventually they will melt away, and Fallout 2 has a fun way of dealing with the Chosen One walking through too much toxic material. The game log will inform us that bunions have begun growing on our feet, and eventually these growths will lead to a whole new sixth toe. This will surely keep us out of any high society settlements, so getting rid of it is a great choice. Going to a clinic that has an auto dock, we can pay to have the toe removed, which will then add it to our inventory. The in-game description reads, You see your sixth toe. It is a small mutated part of yourself. For some reason, you feel a terrible sense of loss as you look at the tiny amputated toe. While some NPCs may claim that this toe can be used on Frank Horgan to instantly kill him, that is not the case, and it's just likely the devs having some fun at the player's expense. The toe will give Frank a debuff on maximum HP of negative 3 though. However, the Chosen One can consume the toe and receive a plus 2 poison level and a week long period of negative 3 max HP. Still, it is quite the souvenir to carry around on your adventures, and you wouldn't want to be separated from such a special part of you. More classics coming right up for you, so stay tuned.